Hi everyone and welcome back to Life Cues week 43 and 44. We're slowly getting through it. So uh, for week 43, um, we had an interesting conversation at one of our doula meetings. Uh, we were telling clients that if they have pet names for each other, to be sure that especially the husband calls his wife the pet names during labor and not to worry if we're there because that's the time if you call her Pookie, that's the time she needs to be called Pookie. So it brought me to think about the prompt, do you use pet names in your relationship? So that's for week 43. And again, we're gonna do two weeks at a time. Week 44 is simply, what do you need right now? What do you need in your life right at this very moment? Okay, so let's get started. <music> Thank you. 
my pages. My first one. Do we use pet names? Me and my husband. So I started off my page with a stamp that I made actually from garbage. It was um, when you used to have to trim your stamp and up stamps, I saved the little bits of rubber stamp and just glued them on the back of a jewel CD case like that. And I find that this, um, this stamp set gives me a great looking kind of a giraffe or animal print when I push, put it down. So that's what I kind of did in the background here. Um, it was quite wet. I probably shouldn't have used so much paint on it, but it gives a really neat kind of animal print, and that's what I was going for. And then at the bottom here, I just used some bag from um, some vegetable produce that we had. It was kind of um, those netted bags that your produce comes in. It kind of looks something like this to sort of represent the grass in my jungle. And then I've got a bear, a little bear there. Those are little Martha Stewart shapes and that little kitten. And the bear is just to represent the nickname Boo Boo. And that's actually what I call my um, grandsons. And the kitten for kitty. And so then I made kind of a stop sign. No pet names. My husband and I do not use pet names. We never have. We've never called each other hun, babe, dear, sweetie, honey. I don't know why we have it. We just never, ever, ever have. If I call him, I say Richard. If he calls me, he says Monica. And that's it. It's just kind of funny. We've never done that. And I'm not sure why not, but we just don't. But if there was a pet name that I would like to be called, it would be Queen Bee. And there I am right there. So the answer to the prompt, do I like to use pet names? It's just it's not that I don't like to. We just don't. I used some uh, an ultra fine sharpie just to put some stitch marks around the page, and this was just a, an old rubber stamp that I had that I think it, thought was quite cute. And added some bling, of course, because I'm the queen bee. So that's the answer to prompt number one, and the second one is on the other side, and that is what am I? What what do I want right now? What I want right now, what I'm craving right now, is some sunshine, some flowers, some butterflies and bugs flying around, a little bicycle. For, for the second prompt, what do I need right now? Not only do I need it, I crave it. Some sunshine. Not only has it been super cold here, but it's also been very, very gray, which is unusual for us. We're used to coping with very, very severe cold temperatures, but we usually have a bright, beautiful blue sky, so it doesn't make it so hard to deal with. But for this winter, for some reason, we've had a lot of gray, gray skies, so I really need some sunshine right now. So this page, I actually found this paper packet that must be a billion years old, I'm sure. It's Lori Gardner Whimsical Season Scrapbooking Kit that I bought a long time ago, and it had some really cute kind of whimsical stickers and stuff in it that just sort of spoke to me today. So I took the really cute sunshine and put it on there. The paper um, is also from that set and I just glued it on the on the back of the card with my ATG gun. And then all these little bugs and butterflies are from there. And there was a tag and I took the stickers and just simply put Crave on there. And then I made these flowers. Here's one right here. And I saw Donna, I think her name is Salazar, uh, I saw a video of her doing these on YouTube and I just love them, they're with newsprint. So if anybody's interested in a tutorial on how to do them, just let me know. But um, So I added another little Prima on top of it and then a green button and then sort of some stickly, can you see the glittery stickles on top of that flower. And then I used this little stamp. I love this stamp, although it didn't stamp that well. The ink was a little dry. And it is, the whole stamp set has a whole series of stamps and it's missing certain parts and you replace them with buttons. 
The stamp set is called Everyday Button Bits, and I got it from Roxy Fur from her store at Your Paper Pantry, and it is so cute. And it just comes with tons of stamps, and I don't know if you can see, like for example, there's the trees there, and the tops are missing, and you would just add buttons. And then there's the bicycle, there's just so many hot air balloons. But I hadn't tried it out yet, and I just thought it looked kind of cute with the bike riding on the trail there. And then I just added two pink buttons for the wheels and some flowers here. So it's kind of a simple page, but it makes me happy to look at it. So what I need right now is some sunshine and some flowers. So those are my two uh, responses to the prompts this week. Do I use pet names? No, we don't, um, but I don't mind if other people do. And what do I need right now? I need some sunshine. So thanks a lot for watching, and I can't wait to see what your answers to the prompts are. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.